Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. Well, hello there, my beautiful Pisces. I hope you are all doing well. Thank you for all the beautiful likes, the comments, the shares, the subscriptions, the donations to my channel. It is greatly appreciated and well received. More than you'll ever know. So, Pisces, before we get into the reading, as usual, I will be putting some good old-fashioned holy water down. And then I'm going to pet the bailiff, because he likes the bailiff pet. Mm -hmm. He's like, Mama, what I really want is the holy waters. He, I know, he hasn't had no holy water. He hasn't had no holy water. Yeah, of course, his pet center only gave him regular water, which was filtered, but still. So, you know what time it is, don't you? Mm, I do. Tarot's noun session. <clears throat> the most honorable judge, T. T. Young, presiding. You can all keep petting your fur babies. So, we're going to check in on the energy of that person you're dealing with, or whatever energy could be potentially approaching you. Like I always tell you, it could very well be your own energy. Whatever the case is, we will get it. We will hit it, and we will quit that shit together like we always do, baby. Yeah. Ooh, the deck's going flippity-flop. Flippity-flop. I know, bailiff. He's like, that deck is going flippity-flop. I know, brother. He's getting up. He's got stuff to do. He's going to go find out what June got up for. June got up. So now he's got to see what she got up. <laughs> he's like, is she going to eat my snacks? Those are my snacks back there. He's so... He just loves food, I tell you what. He's motivated. I can get him to do anything for food. I am not joking you. There's a snack. He'll do it. Show me the energy of the person. My, okay. Show me the energy of the person. My beautiful Pisces is. Okay. Well, somebody's watching you. <clears throat> that is for sure. Looks like somebody here is thinking about telling you how they feel. Oh, brother Pisces. Okay. Okay, but they're in two minds here, so they're feeling stuck. Let me pull out my sword, because you know I like a good sword fight. You're showing up here, man or woman, it does not matter, in their subconscious energy here, their subconscious mind. Okay. Well, <clears throat> let's see. You know I like a good sword fight here, Italian Stero. So let's see why this mother trucker, what's going on with this person? What are they feeling uh, stuck about? What are they feeling stuck about? What's keeping them stuck? Okay. Okay. They're stuck on passion with you. There's something where this person's got some kind of hang up when it comes to the amount of passion that they have for you. So maybe this person doesn't want to Release the Kraken right on you, right away, Pisces. So they're like, oh, no, I better two swords it. I don't want to release my sensual desires and my passion upon the Pisces so soon. Because Pisces may not like that right away. Maybe it's better that I get to know the Pisces. Well, maybe that's probably a good idea. Okay. So let's go a little bit deeper on this energy. And I know they want to get deeper here. Man or woman, it doesn't matter. What's going on here? Let's go a little deeper. Okay. So, yeah, that's what it is. So, they're like, okay. Maybe they just met you, right? And they really want to knock your socks off. Because they're tired of playing with the sock puppet. With the Pisces face on it and the Google eyes. And, uh, so they got a new sock right now. Alright? So, they're like, okay. Maybe I'll just keep using the sock, and then I'll just wait for the right timing here, because eventually, you know, once I can put on my charm here and get to know Pisces a little bit better, I'll be able to knock the socks off the Pisces. So they're not of wands is saying that. They've got, we've got the king of wands, so why is he here? So the, the, basically the king orders the knight. So this person's knight is like, no, 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 no. 
I don't think it's the right time. So the knight reports back to the king. So what's going on with the king now once this knight reports back to the king? Okay. Yes. Yes. I don't want to look like a fool. Okay. So, right? They don't want to look like a, a, an idiot. So, they're going to be like, no, I must act like emperor. Okay, I must act like emperor. Not like, like the, the knight said, no, time, the timing is not right. So the knight came back toward the king. Oh, don't look like a fool here, okay? You need to sit. You need to be patient. And you need to wait for the right time here to come in and do the, whatever you want with the Pisces, okay? Let's get a little bit deeper here on that emperor. That's all I heard. I just heard those voices in my head. I know. It's, I, get, I, hear, I hear voices. I just, uh, not, it's not like that. It's my intuition. People are like, Talia hears voices. Talia hears voices. No, I don't hear voices. So, this is somebody who's going to want to talk to you, okay, and get to what? Know you better. Mm-hmm. Get to what? Have more fun with you. To work on things. Maybe you guys will have like a, a fall party festival or something like that. So this is kind of somebody who, it's cool. I get it. This is good. I like this person. You guys know that most of these mother truckers, I can't stand them because half of them are jack wagons. So this is good. I can dig this person's energy. Okay. So we are going to talk to the, they're watching you though because they're waiting. So let's talk to the waiting and watching energy here right now. Waiting and watching. And this is really hard for them. They're like, this sucks. I hate waiting. I hate watching. So maybe they're watching you walk around, you know, and they're like, oh. So, okay, something, there's a big shift here that happens. What's this big shift that happens under this waiting and watching energy? What is this? Okay, they want to tell you something. What do they want to tell Pisces here? Okay, what do they want to tell Pisces? Okay. You're my obsession. You're my obsession. What do you want me to do? You make me whatever you want. So now there, or it could just be obsessive text messages. Okay, this could be it too. They might say they're obsessed with you. I can't stop thinking about you. That's another form of I'm obsessed with you. But you don't say I'm obsessed with you. You say I can't stop thinking about you. Which basically that means the same thing. I mean, in general South terms, yes, it does. <laughs> or the core general South is Chinese food. I know, but it sounded good, and it just things just come out of my mouth, and I don't have I don't have a real control over things. I really don't. Now in my regular life, it's fun, well, maybe not really. In my I, I say I say the dumbest things. One of my friends texts me now. And he, he, if when he wants to text me, it's my friend's uh, husband. He'll be like, "Is the Duchess available?" And I'll be like, "Uh, the du yes, Duke. I call him the Duke of Madison." I'll be like, "Yes, Duke of Madison, I am available." It's I know it's it's just funny. I'm just weird. I get I like my friends though. They're pretty cool. Okay, let's talk to the magician here. What's going on with the magician? Please? What's going on with the shirt? What was that? Where did we go? Oh, and there is you, Pisces. So somebody here is wanting to meet you cup to cup. That's what it is. That was the their subconscious energy, Pisces. And it came the truck out. And why do they want to meet you? Because this person is very, very lonely without you. And so am I, Pisces. We're going to grab one car for each sign with the kitty boom booms for good old Jesse and Gabby. Mm, after I belch. Hopefully it won't be a loud one. Because you guys know I sometimes belch on accident. It's never on purpose, though. Well, obviously, I don't have control over it. Pisces, how do you feel about Pisces? Okay. Pisces, how do you feel about Pisces? Okay, they're conflicted about you. Cancer, how do you feel about Pisces? Cancer, how do you feel about Pisces? 
Cancer, how do you feel about pie? Okay. They feel like you're cold and distant. Sc uh, Scorpio, yeah. Scorpio, Scorpio. Ha, ha, ha. I broke my finger a few years ago, and sometimes it'll still feel like it's broken. And that was just one of those moments where I felt like it was still broken. It's so weird. Scorpio, it was hurt. I walked around for two weeks with it broken and acted like I was fine. Scorpio, how do you... Okay, Scorpio. Scorpio wants to take that leap with you. Yikes, I like it. Aries. Aries, 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 Aries. Aries, 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 Aries. Okay. Aries is going to reach out to you here. It's going to be like sudden to uh, Leo. Leo. Sure. Leo wants to see you if they have not already. They just like being around you. Uh, did I say, did I say that was Leo? I hope so. If I messed one up, I'm sorry. Sag, forgive me. I'm still on jet lag. Sagittarius finds you to be very attractive. La 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 Libra. La la Libra, la la Libra. La. Okay, Libra. Libra's trying to figure you out right now. Uh, Gemini. J -j 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 Gemini is confused about everything right now. Uh, Aquarius. Aquarius. Okay. They've been thinking a lot about you. Virgo, Virgo, Virgo. Virgo, Virgo, Virgo. Blah, blah, Virgo. Virgo, how do you feel about the best? It's Virgo. Yes, Virgo. Virgo wants to scratch on your scratching post. I wanted to say hi to Aubrey. Hi, Aubrey. I love you. Um, Taurus? Mm -hmm. I just had to say that. For some reason, it came in my brain. They've been thinking about you. And happy, happy, how do you feel about... Pisces, Cap, Cap, okay, Capricorn, you guys are not talking, wham, 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 so guys, you can like, share, comment, subscribe, whatever you want to do, Tarot's adjourned, mm.